junk journal shop so let's see what I purchased from junk journal shop let's just see what we got we have this book cover we can make a journal with all right and we have this is made with a laser um, machine and Johnny makes them if I can find the link to her shop I will uh, link it down below for you guys and y'all can go ahead and purchase it but Y'all can get it finished or unfinished also. And I got the one with the butterfly that says journal. Because, look, you put your signatures here and nothing here. So when you close it, you have that. So that's that. And I think she has a video. If I can find the video, I'll link the video on how to work with these, all right? So now, we're going to put all the rest of this stuff aside. I'm going to pull little by little. So, here we have some, I don't know what these are. Let me see if I can get the name of this. Return this statement for correction. In case of error. Hmm. Let me see. They look like. Some kind of. I don't know. Slip that you put in. With an order or something. I like these. I have to see if she has more of those. Then we have this long strip. This all came in this bag. And then we have this. Okay. We have some months and dates. We have this printable. This says file, but I don't know. It looks like a docket number. Or a docket card or something. Then we have this piece. We have some handmade paper. Some more book paper. Some book paper. A library card. With a tag. A. Uh, kind of like a tab thing. For jewelry. Then we have words. Butterflies. Okay, I'm going to put this all back in the pocket here so nothing gets lost. And we're going to go in here and see what we have. Magnets. So magnets for the journal. We'll see what I use them for. I'm going to put this all back in the bag here. Okay. Then we have this piece of vellum here. And then we have this printable. Okay. So we got that. We have this. These are ledger pages. And I like them because they make good journals. Good journal page. You fold them over. You can make a big pocket. Mm. And then we have this. Looks like onion skin paper. And it feels like it. And then we have a lot of 
coffee dyed papers. Okay. And then we have some of these papers. That looks like some of them has botanicals and other things on them. We have a few of those. Okay. So let's put that aside. We have this. Feels like from an art pad. I don't know. And we have more coffee dye. More ledger. Oops. We have music paper. We have this a scrapbook paper. Okay. We have embossed that can go on either one of the journals or I can use it for a journal cover. We have some uh, ledger paper, line paper that's not written, but this is. So we're going to call this ledger paper. We have this with a tab on it, this paper with a tab. We have more ledger. Hmm. We got tons of ledger paper, y'all. So, if y'all want to purchase anything, I will have her, the link to her Etsy shop down below in the description. And, you know, just look up Junk Journal Shop on Etsy and y'all shall find her shop. So I want to thank, thank you all for watching. Please like, share, and comment. And if you haven't done so already, hit the red subscribe button and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the notification bell to get notified of when I upload new content, when I go live, or when I do a premiere. Please be kind, be caring, be crafty, be safe, be positive, be blessed, and make something pretty today. And I will see you all in the next video. Happy crafting on a budget, happy everything on a budget, and bye bye for now. I'm a crafter, a DIY scrapper. Let's bring our visions to life, you see. Let's create together, hand in hand.